I'm here with David, the Managing Director at Marvels. So David, why would customers use you over a different supplier? Well Sarah, um, we're a fairly small family run business so we have um, a lot of small customers, medium sized customers and we like to pay a lot of attention to looking after their needs and whatever it is they require. So. Um, we pay a lot of attention to detail in our products, but more importantly, we ask our customers what it is they want from us. So, um, from that point of view, if they want small quantities, then we can, you know, focus on that. And whatever it is they want, then we can look after them. If it's quick delivery, or they just want to reduce the risk of buying in large quantities, then that's one reason why they might buy over us. Also, the quality of our products, you know, we we really focus on that. Um, we focus on the quality and the design of the products above the price so most of our customers who've been dealing with us for a long time uh, really appreciate that we can we can obviously service lower price uh, products as well but we uh, have found over the years that most of our customers really want to sell a good uh, quality product that's well designed with good attention to detail at a reasonable price than uh, basically focus everything on price alone what is different or special about your products uh, well, as I say, we take a lot of care and attention in actually um, the real fine detail of the products, the quality of them, how they're finished, the detail of the design, and every aspect of them really. Uh, most of our products uh, on the whole throughout the company have some sort of uh, use, so they might be a candle holder or a food dish or um, something that's usable, so it has um, a secondary sort of sale value to it other than just being purely decorational. So that's a very um, key note for us and uh, everything that we do we base on that fact so we, we won't buy products simply because they're cheaper than somebody else's. It's really got to be focused on the real attention to detail, quality and, and design and those are the most important things for us in our, in our overall range. And do you focus on one particular market sector or customer type? We focus on lots of different market sectors. So as a company, we uh, have a wide range of garden products, garden furniture and sundries. We have um, interior designs and wall decorations, as you can see behind me. We have a big range of general giftware for the small independents and uh, retailers. We have uh, Christmas ranges, as you can see here, fireside and also cast iron ranges. So we have a lot of different ranges and our customers are very diverse. Uh, we have very small, tiny one-man independents, multiple retailers, mail order, we have export customers, we have a lot of online retailers, um, and all in, in all of the sectors. So really we can supply any type of business anywhere in the world with really product to suit them 12 months of the year. Do you feel that customers benefit from anything other than your quality products? Well, <clears throat> other than the products we're very interested in, in helping our customers to run their business efficiently. We run uh, seminars annually where we invite our customers to come in free of charge and we get industry leaders in marketing and merchandising and banking or whatever it is to come in and give their uh, expertise to our customers to help them grow their businesses. So from that aspect then if we know that in the long term if we can help our customers to grow their businesses then we're going to get uh, value back from them over a longer period of time. So that's really, really important to us. And um, looking after them and making sure that we ask them what it is that they want and we sort that out. Because quite often it's not necessarily to do with products, it might be to do with finance or whatever else. So uh, that's a really important area of growth for us for the future. And what do you think customers are really after these days? I think um, on the whole, customers who are still around at the moment, who've gone through the recession so far, are really aware that um, they simply cannot go forward um, simply based on price and outpricing everybody else and these days you have to offer something other than just a product and a price you've got to offer other services and you've got to offer people an experience so we make sure that we treat all our customers on the same level really down to earth um, on a friendly basis that we look after them we listen to their needs more importantly what, what it is that they're after from us um, what sort of products they want, um, how many they want to buy, the sort of quality they want and the design and that we focus on that and I think it's important for um, everybody in the whole industry whether it's suppliers or retailers that they have to focus on the service that they give to their customers over and above uh, the price 
of the products and that they make sure their customers come back to them um, for all of those reasons and it's not just simply a price war that um, nobody really wins at the end of the day. So. And what do you feel is important looking ahead over the next year or two? I think it's really important for us to um, just make sure that we keep focused on quality and service of our customers. We listen to what they want continually, that we keep making the changes that we're making. Uh, we have a very up-to-date website where it's extremely easy for customers to order online. They can see um, our livestock data online so that it means that when they're ordering um, they can order items that are in stock which means they'll maximize uh, their order values and they won't be ordering items out of stock so that's really important that's one of the things that we've done in the last year or so whereby customers are telling us that they were um, you know fed up of ordering stuff and it wasn't in stock so we've now made it possible for them to see what we have in stock so we're listening to what you know problems they have and um, I think that's really important for us to focus on those sorts of things and continually change and strive to keep improving things um, in the right areas um, that, that helps our customers and if we can keep doing that and they can keep doing that for their customers then I, I think that will, that will get everybody through. Thank you very much David. For more information about Marvels visit marvels.com